You don't even have to be a great analyst to figure this out. Wow, are they better. They are all over them tonight. By number 14, Sarah Noel. Drives to the sweet spot. That's blocked. Kitchener's on the attack. Takes the shot. Big time stop there. Scores on the rebound. He pops it. You want money, you go to the bank. You want bread, you go to the store. You want goals, you get into the net. The rebound's there, he puts it away. The Rangers are starting to make people lose track of just how wide this lead is now. Busiest guy in the rink is the guy changing the numbers on the clock. Man, they are awesome tonight. Windsor's got it in the offensive zone. Time of the goal. Takes the feed. Shuts him down. Kitchener's moving it along the wing. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. Well, the ice has sure looked tilted after 40 minutes of play as the second period comes to an end. Hey, fans, great tickets are still available to our next home game. Please visit the box office and get them well they last. Don't go anywhere. The third period is just moments away. The Spitfires are going to swap goaltenders. You ever wonder in a blowout why the goalie leaving skates way faster than the guy coming in? They're ready to drop the puck on period number three. He's Ray Perot. I'm James Sabalski. Let's do this. Here we go. Third period set to get underway. Simply too much to not enough at this point. Well, we've got two periods under our belts to this point so far, Ray. How do you see things? The Rangers are going to be able to stretch their bench out, use four lines, and take advantage of a real comfortable lead. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Windsor's moving it up the ice. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And it's kicked away. And a heads-up kick pass over to his teammate. Grabs it in his own end. The Rangers are in transition. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Finds some space in the corner. Comes up with the stop. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. The Spitfires are on the attack. And he loses control of the puck. Kitchener's got a hold of it against the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Dumps it in. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Made the stop on that play. The Rangers continue to lead big here in this third period. Kitchener's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Grips it and rips it, makes a save, cool and calm under pressure. The Rangers have it from the corner. Oh, if there's going to be a regret in this one, that might be it. Yeah, that play is right there to be had. They just miss the pass, the scoring chance goes away. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Hammers one at the net, just wide. Fires it on net, denies him with the save. Here's a blast, that goes wide. Yeah, he's going to have to adjust the sights on that one. That thing's off target by a long way. The Spitfires played along the boards. Here he is in front. Wide of the net. The Rangers gain control of the puck against the wall. Kitchener's got it in their own zone. The Spitfires go to work on offense. And he misses. That's a good scoring opportunity. He doesn't capitalize on a grade-A chance. The Rangers have it behind the net. 
And he totally whiffs on that one. Busted up on the play. Yeah, you get in the right spot. Sometimes the thing just hits you. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. And he scores! Man, it looks like a bus depot in front of the net. You know it's a tough one when you can't see the goalie. That means he can't see the puck. The Rangers have been all 